On this code, I have about the simplest form you can get with a single input and a submit button. And when I click on the submit button, the actual saving of this data inside the save function is quite slow. There's no loading state shown at all. Now you can get around this by using your own custom state variables to set the loading before you save and then make sure it gets set to false after you save. But there's a brand new experimental hook in React called use form status that does all this for you. So all you need to do is import this use form status hook from React DOM. And now in order to use that, I just need to take our submit button and break it out into its own component. So as you can see, I created a custom component called submit that just has our button. And we can use that form status hook to actually get the pending status. Then we can just make sure we replace this button with that submit component. And up here, instead of an on submit, we need to make sure that this is our action. This will then take in our form data and we don't need to prevent anything because it already is prevented by default. We can just say form data .get and pass it in the name here. And now if I give it a save and I click submit, you're gonna notice that buttons is disabled until my submit finishes. 